His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and Deputy President of the UAE Prime Minister and Ruler of Dubai, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, attended the first GCC Endurance Championship race with the participation of riders from GCC countries for a distance of 120 kilometers. Upon arrival at the Endurance Village, His Majesty was received by the Crown Prince of Dubai, Sheikh Hamdan bin Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, and His Majesty's representative for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, Head of Bahrain Olympic Committee, the Honorary President of the Equestrian and Endurance Federation, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and also by the Head of the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Race Federation, Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa. The race was also attended by the GCC Secretary General, Dr. Abdul Latif bin Rashid Al Zayani. The Highnesses Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad and Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum briefed His Majesty the King with the phases of the race and the riders. His Majesty and his guests met with a number of riders and exchanged talks with them on the championship, which comes to enhance relations and competition among riders of GCC countries. His Majesty the King and His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum lauded the accomplishments made by rider of the GVV during the various race events and different levels. They followed up on the first GCC Endurance Championship. The first place was won by rider Sheikh Hamad bin Delmuk Al Maktoum from the UAE, second place by rider Saif Al Mazroui from the UAE, and third was Saeed Al Mahri also from the UAE. At the end of the race, His Majesty the King congratulated the winners and thanked His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum for attending the race, loading his support for the endurance sport. He affirmed Bahrain's pride in hosting such championships. His Majesty loaded the accomplishments made by Bahraini and GCC riders during various sports events, both regionally, Pan-Arab and internationally. He also thanked His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa for his care and support for such sport. His Majesty the King also thanked the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Race for providing all the resources and facilities for both the riders and the race. His Majesty wished them all every success. At the end of the race, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad, the GCC Secretary General and Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa crowned the winners of the race, including riders Sheikh Hamad bin Delmuk Al Maktoum, Saif Al Mazroui and Saeed Al Mahri, who were first, second and third respectively. His Highness Sheikh Nasser also crowned the UAE team for securing the first place of the championship and the Bahraini team for securing the second place.
The personal representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, President of Bahrain Olympic Committee and Honorary President of Bahrain Royal Endurance Equestrian Federation, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, honored the winners of the first GCC Endurance Championship race held at Bahrain International Endurance Village in the attendance of the GCC Secretary General and Brief President. On the individual level, the first place was won by rider Sheikh Hamad Ben Delmuka Al Maktoum, second was Saif Al Mazure, and third was Saeed Al Mehri, all from the UAE. The UAE managed to rank first and Bahrain second in the team's race. His Highness Sheikh Nasser expressed pleasure regarding the successful hosting of the race in Bahrain and hailed the endurance or attendance of His Majesty the King, which reflects his constant support to the endurance sport. In the attendance of the Deputy President of the UAE, Prime Minister and Ruler of Dubai and Dubai's Crown Prince. His Highness hailed the huge efforts of the organizing committee in hosting the race, which reflects the Kingdom's ability to successfully host such major championships. He also hailed the huge competitiveness between participants of the race and expressed his congratulations to the winners. For his part, the GCC Secretary General praised the attendance of His Majesty the King and His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, which reflect their constant support to youth and sports activities. The first deputy chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, founder of KHK MMA organization, His Highness Sheikh Khaled bin Hamad Al Khalifa, arrived today in the Jordan capital, Amman, to attend the Desert Force Championship at the Arena Hall in the Al Hussein Sports City and to support the Bahraini fighter Hamza Kohiji of the KHK MMA team. Upon arrival, His Highness was received by the acting ambassador of Bahrain to Jordan and a number of Jordanian officials. His Highness expressed trust in Bahraini youth regarding regarding honoring the kingdom in different international tournaments. He stressed that the tournament is a great opportunity to affirm Bahrain's status in various sports fields and in particular the MMA. Good evening and welcome to the Sports News on Bahrain TV. And in horse racing, the biggest winner of yesterday's race was Autumn's Blush, owned by Fawzi Abdullah Nas, trained by Fawzi Nas and ridden by Hussein Mekki, when it beat Gray Z by three lengths to win the Rashid bin Abdurrahman al Jasmi Cup for imported horses, which carried the cash prize of 4,000 Bahraini dinar. Celtic Man was third and Taffy was fourth. Harash, owned by Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdullah Al Khalifa, trained by James Naylor and ridden by Abdullah Faisal, lived up to expectation, beating Farang by a head 
to win the Mohammed bin Abdurrahman Al Jasmi Cup for local breed horses with carried a cash prize of 3,500 dinars. Kate Crusader was third and Nardine was fourth.